This is a Thomas skid loader, and the date today is July the 24th, 2023. I've had a nightmare with this uh, starter. I put a new starter in, and uh, the, I should have disconnected a battery. I didn't, and it sparked off of this uh, starter, and it cost me a fortune. I didn't know what happened. But it, uh, this little, little tiny uh, brass looking thing uh, with tape on one end of it is a uh, 40 amp breaker, okay? It kicked that breaker and it's supposed to reset itself and it did not, okay? It soldered on one end, oh, what a nightmare. So to get it out of there and put a new one in is, I think it's gonna be too hard. I believe I'm just going to try and uh, cross it, bypass it. Anyway, I ended up putting in new fuses. I put in uh, uh, starter relays. Uh, I put in uh, a start-stop relay. Not cheap, not cheap, very expensive. Couldn't solve my problem. And finally, I found this thing. It was behind the starter, and it was covered with black tape. I uh, got out of curiosity, I took the tape off and uh, seen what it was and I got my book and went to page 173 and sure enough, there it is. There's a, there is the uh, 40 amp uh, breaker and that's what, the, that's what kicked. That's why I hadn't had no electricity the last two months found this little devil and to find one like that and braze it on one end is not going to be easy so i'm going to see if i can bypass it i thought i'd share that with you guys this is the thomas 133 and i love my machine but i sure have my share of problems with it hope you guys uh, benefit from me uh, helping you with this or explaining this to you in case you run into the same problem Y'all take care. This is Conrad Riffle in Central Ohio, Blue Akron. All right, thank you, bye.